All right, good morning, everyone. Good morning. Good morning. Okay, very good. Um, this morning, uh, does anybody, or first, I'm sorry, to start off with our mission. Okay, so what are we here for? Serve, serve delight, delight, engage our members, our members while they shop, shop their way. way. All right, very good. Now we're going to go ahead and uh, look at our numbers. Had kind of a rough day. We're starting off with a pretty much a, a rough month at this point as well. So we really need um, to make sure that we're doing the right thing, make sure our store is clean and bright. We're smiling, we're greeting every member as they come through. Very important, you know, we just took inventory and I want to thank everybody for all the efforts that they put forth. I think we had a very good count um, and we'll have the results out soon and I'll let you know what the results were, but thank you very much. So now it's just getting back to, to um, regular business, um, you know, making sure that we straighten up the floor from our inventory, clean up, we, we look like we're in pretty good shape this morning. We can start bringing merchandise now out of the back and restocking the floors. Um, we still are gonna wanna wait until the 26th before we start doing any out of stocks, okay? So please make sure that we do not do any out of stocks until the 26th. But uh, as you can see, a, a little bit rough month going for us. Um, not doing too bad in our, in our back room processes, so we're staying pretty strong there. Member feedback, um, we actually had two good ones yesterday, so the numbers moved a little bit more. Um, but not where we're normally at, at a 75%, we're normally at a 90% or above, so we really need to concentrate on that. Um, the Shop Your Way re rewards loyalty at a 77.65. We, we need to really work on that and get up over the 80% mark. Um, attachments are starting to come around, so that's great. Um, we were down around 13%, up at 15.5%. We really want to move that number up around 20% or so. Um, Okay, does anybody have a focused recognition they would like to do? Becky? Um, this is what showing pride looks like to me. A lot of times we have elderly customers that come in the store and one of their first questions with vacuums or ready to assemble furniture is, can I pay somebody to put it together or will you put it together for me? And of course, you know, we don't do that. But um, Brittany Ayers is always the first one that as soon as a member asks, she jumps right in, she puts the vacuum together for them, she puts it in her car, or she'll offer, she'll say, I'll put the furniture together for you, you can come back later and pick it up. And to me, um, that's delivering a wow experience to the members and what showing pride looks like. Very good, all right. All right. I have, I have one uh, I want to do on Julius. Uh, this would show this would uh, show his pride in uh, giving a wow uh, membership experiences. I was a uh, kind of cash rep, you know, and uh, the salesman was busy with uh, other members, and a member asked about a price on one of the uh, fitness fitness equipment, things like a body or something. I couldn't find the price, and when I went to him, he scanned the form. And uh, to me, like Julius is always. If somebody's busy, he's always there to help out. So, to me, that's what you know, delivering a member of Wow Experience is. Hi. Good job. Amanda? Um, this is what Own It and Show Pie looks to me. Um, yesterday, Eileen and Brian's, after inventory, they went through everything. I mean, everything. They just straightened it up and made the whole store, like, all in fashion, look amazing. I mean, they took the time out. Just make sure everything looked clean and straightened, and that's absolutely wonderful. And that is delivering a wild member experience, but also um, building a team of engaged associates. And that is what Show Pride and Elder looks like to me. All right, good job. Okay, now we want to close the gap, right? So we're going to look over at our store to home. Normally, we're a store that's 140, 150% in our store to home, so we're, we're really off the mark right now. So if anybody can kind of help us out, remember we see it, own it, solve it, and do it to close the gap, right? So if somebody can maybe kind of give us some ideas on what we can do to close that gap with store to home. Okay, in the shoe department, we can, uh, if we don't have the shoe available, you can ask the customer that we can get it online for them, by size, color, different styles, and all online. So you can make sure you offer that to every, or every member that comes in. That's great. That's a good point. The same with um, rings with store to him. You can, um, if somebody doesn't, have, we don't have a particular size in, in a ring, we can order it in that size with store to home. 
or even if they prefer, they see a ring they like, and it's in white gold, and they prefer it in a yellow gold, we can go online and see if we can get the same exact ring in yellow gold instead of white gold. Okay, great point. Yeah, the, the, the biggest thing is, is when our members come into the store, we want them to walk out with that wow experience, right? So, you know, if they come in here and they're looking for something, we should be able to find that for them. If we cannot find it for them here, then that's what the store to home is for. Um, and that really delivers that wow member experience when they go out of here and they can say, hey, they might not have this in stock, but they were able to order it, ship it directly to my home for me. And, uh, you know, I, I have the item that I went out shopping for. So that's great.